What's up, beauties? Editing Sonya here. I wanted to jump in at the beginning of the video as I'm literally sitting here editing the vlog that you're looking at to say Happy New Year. It is currently New Year's Eve and I'm spending the night editing <laughs> and just chilling and relaxing in the house. And I just wanted to come in and wish you guys a very happy January 1st of 2023. I pray that this year brings you enormous blessings and just brings you in a deeper relationship with Christ. Now for me, I am not writing any resolutions. I am just literally being led by God this year into whatever he wants for me. And so as you guys watch my Christmas footage and some flashback footage from the year, I just wanted to say Happy New Year. Thank you so much for supporting my channel. Thank you so much that we are almost at 30K. Thank you so much for all of your love and support. And let's all just hold on to God's unchanging hand as we navigate whatever he gonna bring in 2023. All right, let's get into the video. what's up beauties welcome back to another vlog i am once again in another hotel room out of town again and y'all have got no prep footage of me going anywhere what's new <laughs> so i am here in charlotte again for the christmas holiday i'm home for the holiday in the last vlog i was here for my sister's baby shower i'm here again because it's christmas on sunday it's currently friday right now and we are staying in the exact same hotel me as in me and ozzy <laughs> we're staying in the exact same hotel that we were in let me see if i can put can i put the key look at that Okay, period. And then I can just talk to y'all like this. Okay, cool. Okay, we're staying in the exact same hotel that we were in uh, the last time we were here for the baby shower. So the hotel was super nice and um, it was very affordable for me to bring Ozzy with me. So we're back here again. I touched down in town around five o'clock. It is currently like five, well like six o'clock now. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to get the vlog started. We um, had a little bit of a rough drive. It is super windy and super cold, y'all. It's only like 20 something degrees on the East Coast right now. And it's supposed to get down to like 12 degrees tonight. And the wind is like 50 miles per hour. So it is giving blizzards, sis, okay? Um, so it's kind of a scary drive trying to drive in that high wind. But the Lord ushered us in safely. So yeah, again, just wanted to get the vlog started for the holiday weekend. I'm trying to figure out, okay, y'all, I've been vlogging all this time, right? So I got all this extra vlog footage that I have done nothing with. And I'm trying to figure out if I want to do like a flashback section in this vlog before we get into the holiday stuff. Or if I just want to keep the holiday stuff rolling. I honestly don't know because it really depends on how long this vlog is going to be. Y'all seem to like the long vlogs, but yeah, I don't know. So <laughs> y'all know by the next clip whether I decide to do a flashback or not. Um, but yeah, I'm getting ready to go downstairs because I need to get me some hot water. Because I bought... Um, the stuff to make me some tea because somebody made oodles and noodles in the coffee maker in my room y'all see the coffee maker is like i'm pointing the wrong way the coffee maker is right there so i put i bought all these bottles of water in here right because i'm like man i be gonna have water we're gonna have tea whatever well i'm gonna have tea and we're gonna have like fresh bottles of water uh for the weekend girl i pour the water into the coffee maker when it started boiling it smelled like broth and i'm like why is this smelling like broth girl i put the little cup under there tell me why news noodles and broth started coming out i said who's ghetto tail that made noodles in the coffee maker who so now i gotta go downstairs and get some hot water so i can make me some tea because my throat uh, being out in that wind is not giving um so yeah i'm getting ready to do that 
and me and Ivy are going to call it at night tonight I'm not doing anything um so I will pick the vlog back up either doing the flashback <laughs> or just uh pick it up oh hold on this Kristen calling hello hey say hey to the vlog oh hey vlog <laughs> Hold on one second. But yeah, y'all, let me get it together and I will pick the camera back up in a second. What's up, beauties? Welcome back to the vlogs. It is Tuesday night. Some date in November, you'll see it on the screen. I am headed out because I have a little girls date tonight. Me and my friend Denise are going to see a movie premiere. We actually got invited, well I got invited from Hampton University alumni. I signed up to go and I was one of the people chosen and a plus one to go. Um, girl, not me forgetting the name of the movie that fast. Hold on, where is my phone at? Hold on, my cellular device. The reason why I don't forgot the name of the movie is because, baby, it's got my husband in here. Hold on, y'all. I ain't got my tripod. I ain't got nothing. All I'm worried about is getting to the theater. Okay, so we're going to go see Devotion. Here is my outfit. I'm wearing... Y'all, this is so ghetto. I'm sorry. I don't have my tripod. Moving so quickly. I'm wearing this little cropped Letterman jacket from Shein. Just a little white rib top because it is mad windy and cold outside some leggings and some can y'all even see some combat boots and just this necklace <sighs> a little synthetic ponytail or whatever it is what it is y'all the reason why i'm so flustered is because i low-key think that the star of the movie jonathan majors is going to be here the reason why i think he's going to be here is because it's kind of low-key like a private event they're requiring us to wear masks like they're man masks are mandatory for the whole time that we're there and i'm just like why would y'all be mandating masks unless he gonna be there and then i heard when they did a movie premiere for this movie in atlanta he was there if y'all don't know who jonathan majors is love craft country the upcoming creed creed three my husband and my brain bro if he is here I'm going to die so yeah i'm super excited i'm super flustered but i'm getting ready to head out because doors open at 6 30 the show starts at 7 30 but they're telling people that seating is first come first serve um so yeah i'm getting ready i literally live up the street from the place but denise is meeting me there so I'm getting ready to head over there now just to like secure the space, okay? All right, y'all, so we made it. Here's Denise. We got our, I know, we got our little ticket and everybody's just kind of hanging out at the bar until we can go into the theater. So, just wanna let you know we made it, y'all. I did. Don't say it like that. You went to. Mm -hmm. You're outnumbered, baby. So keep it cute. <laughs> I already knew that was coming. I'm here with the HG crew, I guess. <laughs> Not I guess. I guess. I'm outnumbered. She's, she had those shades. She's outnumbered. And she being sassy. Don't die. Tell her to pipe it down. You see, I'm the one without the drink. <laughs> what kind of drink? one's that one? That looks good. It's the Paloma. Yeah. Y'all better come get one of these. <laughs> It's a chicken. <laughs> what is 
wait, wait, wait. They be like, what is it? It's the chicken salad. Alright, girl. Let me put this in the square. What else did he say after that? That's kind of funny. He be like, from where? Eddie Murray's Stanley. Eddie Murray's Stanley. Cucumbers, onions, peppers, pickles. Girl, that's what they describe it. It sounds so good. cleanup time okay and my room shambles let me show y'all we got suitcases on the floor from these trips that I have taken we have dirty clothes mixed with new clothes we have this bed that looks awful the chair full of clothes hangers that I had to go buy from Target this morning like shambles okay not to mention this room in here two boxes of new stuff and the room itself just looks a mess so i'm about to cut some music on and just try to tackle some stuff. I don't know how much of this I'm going to be able to record for you guys or like feel like recording for you guys because I just have a lot to organize. And, you know, I don't know how well like vloggers, how like vloggers are like able to like do cleanup, cleanups like this and still be like willing to like position the camera so like y'all can see stuff and all of that I just feel like it's just gonna take me a lot longer but I bought my little tripod out so I can make an attempt but if you just you know if the next scene jumps to like everything being clean don't be mad at that either okay cuz just know I tried <laughs> all right let's get the cleaning progress but it is I just cleaned all of these clothes out of my closet these are the clothes that I want to either sell donate or throw away Ozzy is working my last nerves um so this is what the closet looks like thus far look at all those free hangers look at all the free hangers okay so I'm also probably gonna go and through these bags to see what I want to keep or don't want to keep. These are some of my winter boots that I want to put into my beauty room so I can have them out and ready to wear. And I can put some stuff up here for like storage or whatever. These are all the shirts that I'm keeping. I mean, it's still plenty of clothes, okay? And then I want to get up here. 
this is where I keep my skirts and pants purge some of this stuff that I know I'm not going to wear and fold them back up neatly these are all the dresses that I'm keeping right here again I got rid of a lot of stuff but there's still plenty of stuff here okay um, some blazers and some jackets that I normally reach for during the fall and winter and then this monstrosity down here you can't see it because it's covered in clothes but there are three you see this there are three plastic bins full of stuff now some of this stuff is like swimwear that I need to put up for the fall and winter but I'm gonna go through this mind you this is what I've already like set out to purge I still got clothes on the bed <laughs> and I have clothes in the dirty clothes hamper but again look at all these free hangers y'all i'm making progress trust me and i know y'all are like excited because y'all like oh that means she's gonna have a big closet sale <laughs> if y'all have ever done a closet sale you know how much work goes into doing a closet sale and when you have a mass amount of clothes like this it's just much easier to donate them drop them off somewhere to let them be donated so i'm gonna see like some stuff that i feel like i genuinely do want to sell but if it's just like stuff that that's old that i've worn out that needs to be thrown away or really just given away then i'm gonna give it away because this is gonna be too many clothes for me to put up on poshmark to sell and try to function doing all that by myself okay so I'm not that desperate to make some money off of these clothes because most of these clothes were given to me for free. So, then we still have the beauty room, which I put some of my new jackets up over here, but I still gotta go through these things here. And there's a whole nother closet over here. Ozzy, get out the way, get out the way move move there's a whole another closet that's full of coats and jackets and when to wear shoes down here like there's a whole another situation going on so i'm going to tackle this while i'm in the mood to tackle it or else it's just not gonna get done. Ozzy. He acts like a little brat whenever I am cleaning up and it is so annoying because I have to discipline him for the smallest freaking things so that he understands that I can't attend to you right now. I'm doing something. Come on, come out of this room. Come, go. I threaten him with his little water bottle. I know it says glass cleaner, but y'all, this is water. I promise. I'm not poisoning him, okay? So, I know I haven't been recording this process, but whew, it's a lot to do. So, I'd rather just show you the progress that I'm making as I make it, okay? Because... I can't be worried about moving the camera and angles and carrying on. And plus, I'm trying to play my music and I need the vibe set. So, let me go ahead and make more progress. And then, I'll show you the ending results. Ooh, I look a mess. It's okay. Ooh, it's okay. It's okay. Okay, y'all. It is hours later and I look a wreck. Okay? But, it is 6 o'clock. I have done so much work I am exhausted um, and every and I'm not even done I'm just stopping for the night because I just literally can't do anything else but let me show you what I did get done needless to say I thought I was gonna be able to like be ready to film tomorrow I'm not filming tomorrow I'm gonna have to pick another day this week to film the jack she in jackets haul because i am exhausted and i'm still not done like i still like i did all the clothes stuff that i wanted to do but now i gotta like vacuum and like actually like clean stuff okay so
so I know it's kind of dark in here. You can't really see, which is another thing I hate about this closet is the lighting is trash. But this down here, these four bins now just contain loungewear, pajamas, t-shirts, like throw on stuff. So if like these bins get junky again, it doesn't really matter because now it's just lounge throw on stuff. I'm not like looking for like actual pieces of clothes in these bins. So I don't really care if this gets unorganized because this is just like leggings, sports bras, all that stuff. Okay. So y'all saw my shirts. I put a whole bunch of like sweaters and blazers over here. I brought out like my winter sweaters and blazers and jackets that could fit over here. Of course, I told y'all that I had already like went through my dresses and everything um this up here even though it doesn't look like it i did go through all of this my pants these are my pants and my skirts up here and i went through all of this and picked out what i wanted to keep and what i didn't want to keep is this the neatest most like put together no but it's just gonna have to do and then i don't know if y'all remember my heels that were once in my beauty room on top of my wardrobe i put them up here so that i could then take my winter boots out I have these random pair of Tims up here that I need to sell because they're too small for me. That's just like me reminding myself to not forget that they're up there. Um, so yeah, did this. Y'all look at all the clothes I have to give away and or sell. Those two bags in the back are definitely going to Goodwill. This is a possible closet sale bag. This is a possible closet sale bag. And this is a possible closet sale bag. Plus the two boxes that i did feel that are also packed to the brim with clothes that are closet sale boxes now laundry still here bed still unmade this situation over here looks diff this situation over here looks decent the carpet is not vacuumed nice stand still junky but the clothes have gotten themselves together now in the beauty room i'm gonna come in here and I'm going to shut the door behind me because Ozzy has been getting on my last nerves. In the beauty room, as y'all saw earlier, I had already put out some of my jackets. Um, some of these jackets are in the upcoming haul that I need to film. So I wanted to put them over here. Um, and then I also did my jackets over here. So these are just like coats my favorite coats that i usually am going to grab my favorite boot winter heel boots that i usually grab to wear my hat and then i put my other like basic boots down here y'all hear how out of breath i am like i have been like climbing on top of stuff pulling stuff down carrying heavy stuff i'm exhausted but boots down here these are just like flat boots look at all these black shoes i don't need not another black shoe okay but this this box over here are shoes that I actually want to sell um, right here. And then I didn't do anything over here any different. I just put my Uggs right here because I know I'm probably going to reach for them. And in this closet, let me move the ring light out the way. In this closet, it, it's not going to open up all the way because my Uggs is right there. But these are all like the dresses and stuff that were hung up over here before I just put them in here some extra like little sweaters and stuff that I couldn't fit anywhere and then up here is just like I just do stuff up here as you can see this is like scarves and winter hats these little colorful bags and then hoodies <laughs> and that is that y'all that is Hey y'all, so just in case I did give y'all the flashback footage, welcome back to the current month of the holiday scenes. If I didn't do that, I'm just popping in to say that I got my tea situation together, okay? I went downstairs to the front desk and they gave me a cup of hot water and I just put my tea and my Theraflu in here because my throat is feeling a little challenged from being out in this wind. Um, I got some green tea, some Theraflu, and some sugar-free apple cider in here. That's like one of my favorite concoctions to just get my immune system together and my throat together. So yeah. <laughs> but I just want to let y'all know I got my tea. So I will pick the vlog up tomorrow. Um, tomorrow 
on the agenda. I'm supposed to be stopping by to see Chloe. Um, she is very close to being due. Her due date is January 11th, um, but she is, I think, I can't remember, is she 37 weeks? I can't remember, but she at that point where she can be due any day now. So we all just kind of on watch. Um, she is what we call good and pregnant. So I'm gonna stop by tomorrow to see her, and then tomorrow night I gotta go up to Kannapolis, which is the um, town where my family, all of my family currently lives, um, to help set up for Sunday. So we're having Christmas brunch. We're doing something a little different this year. So we supposed to be doing something a little different this year, honey. You know black people don't never eat on time. So we gonna see. But we're supposed to be doing like a Christmas a brunch this year where everybody is wearing pajamas this year. So my mom bought me, her, my brother, and my niece and nephews all matching pajamas with our names on it. So I gotta go pick those up from her tomorrow. And then I'm gonna, while I'm there, just help them kind of set up and prep and stuff. And matter of fact, I need to cash out my mama some money um, so she can pick up some stuff. But yeah, y'all. So I just wanted to come in. Look at Isaac chair. As he said, I'm finna go to sleep because you playing. Um, just wanted to come in and catch y'all up with where I'm at, and I will see y'all tomorrow. Okay. Good morning, guys. It is Christmas Eve. Merry Christmas Eve, you guys. Why am I so zoomed in? Wait a minute. Okay. Merry Christmas Eve. <laughs> it is like 9 a.m. Me and Ozzy just officially got up for the day. Look at my pretty view. Is it gonna focus? Um, there we go. So y'all remember when uh, me and Kristen stayed here the last time she had this view? So I'm on the same side that she was on before. And Ozzy is somewhere in the room, not playing with his toys. But anyway, I'm getting ready to walk downstairs and get some breakfast they the last time i was here they had like to go boxes where you could bring the breakfast back up to your room so i hope they have the same thing um as i said yesterday today i'm just planning to put on some clothes go see my sister and then wait for my mom to let me know when to come up to my aunt's house so i can help them excuse me so i can help them prep so yeah i uh literally just do on the same sweats and shirt that i had on yesterday because <laughs> i ain't showered or nothing yet and um about to change my shoes throw these little moccasins on and go get some bread feast so i'll come back whenever i get my little plate girl okay okay y'all so just came back from downstairs here is my food they didn't have the um <clears throat> to go boxes but they did have these little trays that you could take um i've been trying to be more cautious about my dietary choices so i just got a few little things um <clears throat> i ain't gonna lie i feel like i'm gonna end up stopping by starbucks <laughs> i feel like i'm gonna end up you know just running by to get some egg bites or something like that on the way to my sister's house because this is probably not going to really like do much for me you know it's hotel it's like your standard continental hotel breakfast so yeah um and now ozzy is i don't know reason so i'm sitting here about to watch some forensic files and eat and then i'm gonna call my sister to see what time uh she wants me to come through <clears throat> y'all hear the in my voice yeah not doing no makeup today we're gonna let the hair do her thing and i'm just gonna put on a cute warm outfit um and we're gonna call it a day but it is christmas eve y'all it honestly feels like another regular day <laughs> But glory be to God, we give him all the praises because this is his holiday. Um, and like I said, I spent all, the whole five-hour drive yesterday just worshiping and listening to gospel music and just 
you know, keeping my mind on him. I know like this time of the year is very rough for everybody. Look at Izzy. <laughs> it's very rough for a lot of people um, due to several reasons. Loss, seasonal depression, all of the things that you can name. And I've just been kind of been trying to be more mindful about um, not letting external things keep my mind off of the fact that this is a holiday to celebrate our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ who delivers us from all of these things that we suffer from in this life. So um just wanted to glorify him and speaking of that i haven't even prayed this morning so i need to i need to pray <laughs> this morning. but um yeah so i will pick the camera back up after i get cute okay i was gonna like let y'all maybe i will i was gonna try to like let y'all get ready with me especially since i'm not doing no makeup it'll be like quick but um I don't know, we gotta get the lighting and the angle right in this room. It's kinda it's kinda dark since I'm on the back side. The sun is on the other side, so but we'll try to make it do what it do. Alright, let me eat. dressed and ready to go about to head to my sister's house i got some i got the cartoon network playing for ozzy he's getting ready to take a nap finally okay <laughs> but yeah we're gonna try to go get some lunch the breakfast was okay it was to as be expected um so we're gonna go get some lunch and then hang out for a little bit i'm a little out of breath because I'm trying to put ugg boots on i got tights on up under these um uh wild legs pants and so trying to put my ugg boots on anyway y'all y'all understand so let's head out okay <laughs> hello hello it is 20, 21 degrees. 21. That's it. <laughs> Baby, it's cold. Baby, it's cold. Okay. Uh, I made it to my sister's house. Say hey, Eric. They can't see you standing in the light. What's that? What's that? That's Bishop Bryce. I call him Bishop Bryce. That is my sister's man. Y'all saw him on the um baby shower vlog. So Chloe went upstairs to go put her um clothes on. We got reservations for brunch on Christmas Eve. Did I tell y'all it was Christmas Eve? Yes, I did. Okay, yes. So we sent to head out and um get some food. I'm just, I don't got comfortable on the couch, baby girl. <laughs> My sister got these couches that are fire. I, I come over here and be like, I'll be right here until she gets ready to come downstairs. So yes, um, oh, let me show y'all this that my sister got for the baby. Hold on, let me get up. Let me get up. Yeah, 
look at the baby stroller. Isn't it cute? And then she got this sign right here that says, please don't, can you see it? Please don't touch or kiss. Your germs are too big for me. Isn't that cute? <laughs> That's very much my sister's vibe. Like, don't touch, don't breathe on her, don't look at her. Y'all got germs. And that's period. But yeah. Uh-oh. But yeah. So, we're just about to go get grab some food. And, um, we're going to some restaurant that I ain't never been to before. So, yes. Check back in with y'all in a second. I'm so groovy. I am Pluto. I'm so groovy, I got power. I'm so groovy, I got power. I just bought it. I'm so groovy, I got power. I'm so groovy. Alright, y'all, so we had lunch. Now we are at Zilla's. Because Chloe got the fan, this is me and an extra kid. <laughs> uh, so we're at South Park Mall. If y'all are not familiar, this is like the bougie mall. It ain't bougie no more, Oh, really? Yeah. I mean, it's still bougie. It's bougie though. This is where all the, you know, people with coins come. They're rich. They're rich. I'm about to say they close. <laughs> so anyway, yeah. We getting ready to find something for Bishop Bryce. It's gonna be a short trip. You need one of them little things. Tell me. Come on, come on. Uneasy to me, right? I'm still right quick. Uneasy, free. You should tell off of me. You are too heavy for my knee. I think it's about uneasy. I might just walk around here to H&M because I know. Find something here from him and I'll be. I'll be able to find something for long or something. I'm gonna just take my time. Take your time. Y'all. So if y'all follow me on my Instagram, y'all know I've been racking it up in Old Navy. I'm gonna be in the women's section. I'm gonna see if they got some more turtlenecks. Cause I only got a red one. The last time. A red and gray one. No. They got different stuff in this store. I don't see the stuff in here they got back home in VA. So, yeah. They ain't had no turtlenecks. Hey, headed to H&M. Mm -hmm. It's different. I like it. a leather cap. It's, it's light. Yeah. I wouldn't get it in cologne. No, I wouldn't get lotion. I wasn't recording the whole time. <laughs> you want to be in the vlog? Say hi. Hey, how you doing? This is your boy, Pilot Sammer. Voice <laughs> base is Charlotte, North Carolina, 704. Okay. <laughs> yeah. The line, though. How's Soraya? 
Um, she's good. <laughs> right, just ate, honey. <laughs> so, we're gonna wait though. Yes. We're gonna wait, even though Bishop Bryce didn't wanna come out to eat with us. Uh-huh. I would have gone one. <laughs> From um Shein. I see that shit can do that. It do. But I got like three or four of them. How much? This is like twenty five. She said she got her I got my two um Hey. Hey, little thing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yo, we at H&M. They have run out of bags. Look at all the stuff she got on the register. Yeah. So we gotta carry the stuff. They can't see you. She do YouTube. Yeah. Hi. <laughs> uh, we gotta carry our stuff because they don't have any bags. Yeah, they ran out of bags. So I'm putting this on camera for evidence. No, you're not on here. But just know, we ain't stole nothing. They don't have no bags. Boom. And she's steady picking up stuff. No, we got to keep in a little bit. You know, this in a little bit. I know y'all. We gonna be looking like we just ran out the store. Yeah, they gotta take this. I don't know. I'm sorry. I do. Where's my menu? Baby, listen, let me tell you. You ain't got no trash? Okay, you, got, you have a large, like, it's like, bags. Trash bag. Trash bag will be perfect. Thank you so much. <laughs> I can't carry this in my hands, I'm sorry. I mean, y'all ain't got no type of damn, um, uh, it must have failed that part on the test when they say when you in a, uh, can you adapt to stressful situations? Well, well, I ain't saying all that, I'm just saying. It's Christmas time, a lot of people been shopping, they ran out of bags. So we gonna put it in a trash bag, call it a day, okay? <laughs> They're not gonna think nothing yeah, because we're gonna have our receipt. I'm not gonna need help with all this. Uh-uh, let me help you. Yes, okay. Go ahead, did you try to ring everything up? Okay, because okay. we're gonna fold everything and put it in here for Because she gotta take the, uh, what you call it, off anyway. Get some snack gas. You rude everything? Uh, look, no, he's talking about using the store for clout. Baby, we are black. We not yeah, trying to get stopped, okay? No, no. <laughs> you bring everything up? What's your child in there? It's um. Uh, simply Sonya. All right, I'll just do that. Thank you. Look, we got, we got subscribers. Yeah, you got to. Man, I do the same thing. I got a boy. Oh, you got a YouTube channel? Of course. Yeah. Okay, cool. Thank you. Pardon me, sir. Sorry. Sorry. And Sonya is S O N. Hey, whoever popped that damn gong gong was loud as hell. No. <laughs> hey, man, okay. Yeah. Oh, you do? You do travel blogs? Yeah. Oh, where have you been? Wow. Oh, the Bahamas, like Bob. Shout, shout your channel out. Don't subscribe to my channel, Life with My Son, and I'll definitely send it to you. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Lord. Okay. So all this stuff you get ring of everything, right? Okay, I just wanna make sure it's here. Let me tell you right now. Same you just said before five three. Yeah. Right. You get money back. You got the call? Yeah, fam. Alright, double the credit. Alright, okay. right, David. Like oh, I'm robbing. Okay. I'm my life. It's okay. This is, this is an experience. Oh, this is I feel like I need to be in the Yeah, put my car around. Close in. It's so legit. Put my flashes on. Walk around this store yeah. with a bag of clothes. You can look in this store. Yes, that's me. No, you're fine. Thank you. Oh, that's the security guard that anybody's talking about. We're going to have our receipts. Yeah. It's my love. Get on the team. It's not my name. <laughs> 
If you want to be for real, I mean, you can put it in the You got a marker, we can write H&M on the... Uh, there, you want a receipt, Pop? Please. Everything the second on the bag. I'm being fussy. You feel safe with me. Thank you. Thank Thank you. Y'all be blessed. I pray something work out. What's on your phone? The market is sick today because it's Christmas Eve. Okay, don't take the mat with you. There you go, baby. All right, y'all. Bye. <laughs> Let me carry it and you hold the camera. Let me carry it because I'm about to put, put these niggas on black. That was ghetto. That was real ghetto. We done got all these clothes. They ain't had no bag. Now we walking through the mall like we done stole the stuff out the stuff. This is your feet. Look at this. Bless the heart. <laughs> Woo! Anyway, let me show y'all the trees. with me because uh this thing turned get up real quick and i just didn't expect not to be able to have no bag now i was wondering why that boy kept looking at me at the because he kept looking at me the kid cashier kept looking at us and when we finally got up there he said all right so this is the deal and i'm looking like what's what's the deal we ain't got no more bags what <laughs> we be like what we legit are carrying around clarence clothes bishop bishop i mean bishop rice the fact that you didn't want to go eat with us today and i'm carrying your clothes <laughs> in a gallon sized trash bag where for your pregnant girlfriend period you owe me dinner yes okay you owe us i just want some starbucks <laughs> um and my bladder didn't got full, Jesus. We gonna have to stop. We gonna stop at the dealers. All right, bye y'all. See y'all later. How we do it? But this, babe, let me tell you what the hell happened to me and son. So, first of all, why did I come this way when I could have literally went back out? Oh no, I still would have had to come around. Why we in the H&M store getting stuff? Get to the register. The man gonna say, "So, let me tell you what's. Let me just tell you now. Um, we ain't got no bags." I said, "What? What the hell? You mean you ain't got no bags? <laughs> what? <laughs> they ain't had no bags." And so, <laughs> one of the cashiers recognized Sonya from her YouTube, right? And so, um, luckily the girl was like super like nice, right? Um. The, I was like, y'all ain't got no type of garment bags, no nothing. Because, like, we had a whole bunch of stuff. And so, um, they were like, no, we don't have, we don't have anything. I said, what? I said, where's the manager? And here go the girl. They right here standing beside us. It's these two right here. She <laughs> <laughs> I'll let you know here. Because it's crazy. <laughs> Damn bags on Christmas Eve. Are y'all are y'all insane? And then they took Look, the hangers. Then they wouldn't give us the hangers, babe. Yeah, this ghetto. Ghetto. And I told them, I said, I'm recording because if y'all think me and my sister finna walk through this mall with these clothes in our hands without no evidence. Exactly. Like y'all don't like y'all don't stole it. Babe, we look like we straight stole the girl. I said, um, y'all ain't got no trash bags or something. And so the, the people was like, well, um, trying to say no. And the girl was like, no, here, uh-uh. He, she grabbed it. She was like, just give it to him. <laughs> oh, my God. I, she took the bag. Whew, that was a crazy-ass experience. Okay, y'all, so y'all walking around looking like boosty. Yes. With a, with a receipt stapled to the trash bag. <laughs> and it was a clear trash bag at that.
Oh my God, babe. I have never. I have oh. never. Where y'all at now? Uh, home, coming home. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> that was enough for me. Merry Christmas, everybody. I'm rushing. I'm headed to go pick up my grandparents so I can go to my other grandparents' house. I'm supposed to be there by one. I'm just leaving at one. I cut the camera back on. Come now y'all on camera. Since you keep talking, <laughs> since you keep talking, you on camera now. This is my, this is my cousin. <laughs> Put me on there. Put me on there. Put me on there. Hey, Hampton. Hey, Hampton. We got Central in the house. We got NCCU in the house. Oh, Lord. Yeah. We don't yeah, rival y'all. Yeah, you know how we do it. Nah. We don't Even rival y'all because y'all y'all not Howard or Norfolk, so you all right. Yeah. We okay with Central. Y'all yeah. in a whole other bragger. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> And he's making, a, he is dividing up the fruit tray, the cheese oh, yeah. tray, y'all. I'm being cheap, you know what I'm saying? He said he's gonna buy I took, one. I took, yeah. I still been taking to my aunt house. <laughs> and I brought it over here. And I said, I'm gonna get in half and take my aunt half. I'm gonna just show up late at my aunt house for right. half the food. Right. That's how we do it. You work smarter, Merry not Christmas. harder. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. <laughs> I, want, I, want no, I need footage. Like the uh the real housewife I mean house husband of, of Charlotte. The is real house husband. Yeah, Kevin Hart started. Yeah, is uh, that is that what it's called? Hollywood. Oh, Hollywood husbands or something like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we need to do the Charlotte, the Charlotte husband. Yeah. What do you think, man? Honestly, honestly. Yeah, I'll just be a husband. Yeah, that's what I'm in. Mecklenburg County, just group yeah, Concord yeah. and group it all together. That's where I'm at, in Cabarrus County. Yeah, the best they can use the trash out in the Yeah. So, some big plastic Christmas bags. From the dollar store. And put them in there. Or Amazon, and put them in there. You can separate. You it's a Canon G7X. They look like, uh, they just look like trash bags. But they <laughs> I use affordable loosely. And then this was like thirty dollars for the whole thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Look, there you go. Say cheese, Santa. It's a beardless Santa. <laughs> That's okay. You don't need teeth to smile. How you doing, man? They're messing with him over here, Rode out there 
said it's the day after Christmas, it's Monday, and my sister is having contractions. Ah! Let's get in the bathroom, boo. <clears throat> she having contractions, y'all. She been having them since last night, pretty frequently um, and consistently. So we might be going into labor today. I don't know. We might be. Throw something on and run to Starbucks and just kind of, you know, be on standby just in case I need to go to the hospital. <laughs> so exciting. I'm literally like I have, I just rolled out the bed. Like she's been texting me since last night about her um, contractions and um, Hold on, y'all. <laughs> My lash just is falling out. Um, but yeah, she been texting me last night about her contractions and just keeping everybody on standby. The nurse was saying that she's in early labor. Um, so they didn't want her to come in last night. They wanted her to wait for a little bit. So this morning, I just called her and she's sitting in a tub of hot water and um she said her contractions are intensified now so she's calling her nurse back and we might be seeing little baby Soraya today or you know tonight early tomorrow morning we'll see so I'm just gonna get up and get myself kind of situated and um <clears throat> brush my teeth <laughs> Just in case I gotta fly to the hospital. <laughs> so exciting. <laughs> so let me do that, y'all. And then I'll pick the camera back up. Okay, y'all. My sister is officially headed to the hospital. Well, she might be there by now. I went out, got some gas, got Starbucks, and I am going to the We having a bib, hey, 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 we having a bib. Whew, not me being sad. <laughs> um Y'all, I'm so excited. This is my sister's first baby. And I'm blessed that she's going into labor while I'm home. Like what? God is so good. So, I'm gonna head out. I came back to make sure Ozzy was good, fed him, got him situated in the room, and hopefully by tonight, baby Soraya will be here. <sighs> so exciting. Um, she did give me permission to film. Girl. <laughs> she did give me per permission to film. However, I don't know how much I'm gonna actually put in this vlog. Um, I want to film something for her, like special for her and Eric. Oh, yeah. So, um, yeah, if you don't see, if you don't see anything about the hospital in this vlog, then of course for privacy reasons. But yeah, just know it's time. It's here. It's happening. I'm excited. Okay, I gotta go. Okay, bye. <laughs> you guys, we are in the hospital. The hospital. <laughs> There's Dad. Right. So we are three, well we as a collective, are three centimeters, centimeters dilated. She's at a 4.5 pain level. She's I'm going to shout out to Baby Dad who made this work. Yes. So we see, we wanted to help when you came home. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Yes. So I'm still here for Christmas and we're having a Christmas baby. Yeah. 